I am a proud partner of Car Marshall. If you are interested in a new or used car, please check out Car Marshall. Click on the link in my description box below. No credit check, no cosigner. That's Car Marshall. Granville T. Woods was born April 23rd, 1856 in Columbus, Ohio. Due to his many inventions, he was known as the Black Thomas Edison, which is a slap in the face because Thomas Edison was the one that kept trying to steal all of his inventions. Granville T. Woods was the genius who invented the railroad system, the automatic brake, and although many historians give credit to Alexander Graham Bell for the invention of the telephone, Granville was the one who improved the clarity and the volume. By many historians, Thomas Edison is known as the greatest inventor of all time. But Edison was stealing inventions left and right. This dude wasn't creating all those inventions. He was a thief. Edison and Woods fought over inventions twice in court, with Granville winning both cases. Now he won both lawsuits. Think about how much evidence he had to have in the 1800s to win a lawsuit over a white man. And not just any white man. We're talking about Thomas Edison, the so-called greatest inventor of all time. After Granville won the second lawsuit, Thomas Edison offered him a job to come work for him. Granville declined. Now being a black man during this time, he would have probably went broke trying to hold on to his inventions. So he started selling many of his patents. Instead of going to work for Thomas Edison, Edison became his number one customer. Back then you had to do a lot of traveling to sell those inventions. So instead of him risking being robbed or killed, he sold a lot of his patents to major corporations. But with Thomas Edison being his number one customer, but they call him the Black Thomas Edison. Salute to Granville T. Woods. Thanks for watching. Make sure you hit the thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. And let me know what you think in the comment section.